Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everybody's well. All right, it's Sunday night. Um, once again, a couple of days behind on reading, so we're gonna hop right into it as soon as I get dressed here and get my cards out. Um, Capricorn, it is your turn for your October round two reading. So this reading will be for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do. The message can be the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. Just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. You can check your Moon, Rising, and Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that might resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play it from the perspective of a cross watcher. Although. This really isn't a cross watchers reading, I'm not gonna lie. Um, this goes more into Capricorn's strengths and weaknesses, what needs to go, what's coming in, what you gotta do to get the desired outcome that you want. All that happy jazz, so. All right, but cross watchers, if you take something out of it, that's okay too. Okay. As always, everybody's always welcome to my table, so thanks for coming by. If you're new here, I think you might want to come by some more, hang out, think we vibe, you can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, hit the like button anytime you want. If you're returning, thanks for coming back. I appreciate you wholeheartedly from the bottom of my heart, the depths of my soul. Again, hit the like button anytime you want. It all helps the channel and it all helps the video be circulated to those who might need the message. So. Before I invoke and throw them down for you, Capricorn, there's two things we gotta go over. One, never make a life altering decision based on a tarot reading. I don't care whose cards they are, mine or somebody else's. And two, if it's not your reading, not your story, not your message, if it's not vibing with you in any way, shape, or form, and it's not making sense in your life, leave the cards on the table and walk away. It was not meant for you. Okay. Tipping it down. Here we go. Heavenly Father, Mother of Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, and I ask for any messages you have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for what's left of the month of October. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me tonight. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given and I ask that you help me use it to bring Capricorn to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Capricorn, what is up with this? Hmm? Why are you so unhappy? That made me sad. Why are you so unhappy? Okay. Okay, well, what's your strength, Capricorn? You're not one for conflict or drama. All right. Okay. What's your weakness? Mm. Hmm. I'm feeling a sense of avoidance. We'll throw a clarifier on it in a minute. What do you want, Capricorn? The wand, you want communication from someone? Forward movement in a situation, possibly? What's got to go? Princess of Swords. Mm. Hmm. 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 You're being watched. I feel like you're being watched. It's a good possibility. Hmm. It might be an, I don't know. Hold on. What's coming in? Seven of Wands. Triumph. Nice. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. All right, what do you gotta do? Princess of Pentacles. What is the outcome? Temperance. That's not a bad outcome. That's balance, positive energy. Huh. All right. Universe is our spirit guides. A couple quick shuffles here. Hey now, these poor cards, we'll get them replaced at some point. What's this 
five of wands reversed for Capricorn strengths. Oh. Six of Wands, Queen of Cups reversed. Ace of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles. You don't even shift your focus into other people's crap. You don't feed it at all. You don't. You're focused on your own victory, your own abundance, doing your own thing. Y'all locking it down. Nice. You close the door on that crap. All right, what's the weak? Why is the lovers reversed here for the weakness? Why the lovers reversed? Empress reversed. Hierophant reversed. Avoidance. King of Swords, you're extremely guarded. I feel like some of you ha want absolutely nothing to do with anything like committed or anything with any potential of becoming anything. Your emotions are very guarded. Why the Eight of Cups reversed? Mm. Oh, well, shit. I feel like some of you are just like, you know what? Um... I'm not putting any energy into it. I'm not putting any energy into it. I feel like if something were to walk back towards your way, you wouldn't put any energy into it. Definitely not. Hmm. Hmm. What's the other ones? What's the other ones? Oh, wow. It, like, went flying. <laughs> Night of Wands. It's the potty pony. What? Communication, forward movement. Three of Cups. Reun <laughs> Reunion. Togetherness. Someone's watching. You want forward movement with someone who's just watching. Upright reversed. Huh, okay. Why is the Princess of Swords here for what's got to go? Why the Princess of Swords? Princess of Swords upright, Knight of Swords reversed. Four of Swords. Queen of Pentacles. Four of Cups. Somebody needs to speak. Somebody 
Somebody needs to speak. Either you view somebody as a catch or somebody views you as a catch. There could be some heartbreak issues. Maybe that's why you're so closed off. You don't want to deal with the drama. It is swords reverse. You want somebody to get out of their head. You want to get out of your head. You want somebody to speak. You want something to move forward. Something's been stuck. Okay. Okay. Why is the Seven of Wands here for what's coming in? Why is the Seven of Wands here for what's coming in? Five of Pentacles reversed. Four reversed. Shadow side. Why the Four reversed? the shadow side. It's your card, by the way, Capricorn. Just in reverse. This is somebody you couldn't trust in the past. This is triumph over self-defeating thoughts. This is triumph over something that didn't manifest. Are some of you putting your own mind in some kind of weird trickery? One more. The Seven of Wands is the... Yeah, death and... The, yeah. That page of pentacles and death. This is like spiritual change. This is metamorphosis. This is this is the demon you can't see. This is you rising up above it. I feel like you got something huge coming in, but but Someone needs to speak. Someone needs to lay something to rest to build a foundation. Somebody needs to get out of their head. Why is this four of cups here? Three of ones reversed. Somebody needs to stop contemplating. Somebody needs to get out of their head about the cup. You're so closed off. You want nothing to do with it. You're so guarded. Stop overthinking it. You need to stop overthinking it. You want forward movement, right? Okay, well, move it forward, Capricorn. You got something coming in, but you have to disconnect from these self-defeating thoughts. You have to disconnect from that which did not manifest in the past. You have to heal the broken heart. You have to allow change within yourself. You have to trust yourself. All right, Princess of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. What you got to do? Why is this Princess of Pentacles here? Hanged man in the Five of Cups reverse. You have to get yourself out of this state of sadness. Get yourself out of the gallows. So you can either take or accept an offer. Sorry, make or accept an offer. Ace of Swords reversed. Seven of Cups reversed. Get to cut the confusion. The moon. Yeah, it's a dark, scary path. It is.
But sometimes when you're walking on a dark, scary path, you got to use the light of your intuition. Intuition is not fear. Intuition is not self-doubt. Sometimes we think self-doubt is intuition. Sometimes when we doubt ourselves, we think it's our intuition saying it. It's not always. You have to sort it out. All right, why is temperance here? Why is temperance here as an outcome? I love this. This is the mixing of two cups. This is positive energy. This is patience with the process. Seven of Pentacles. Ace of Wands. You gotta be careful with that Ace of Wands. Sometimes that match goes out as fast as it was lit. Six of Pentacles. That Six of Pentacles is reversed. Why is the Six of Pentacles reversed? Justice reversed. King of Cups reversed. You have to allow. You have to allow it. You can't be closed off to it. You have to allow balance to come in. You have to be patient. I feel like this is don't start anything too quickly. The Page of Pentacles moves slowly. Something is coming in slowly, so you must approach it slowly. You want it quickly. You can't have it quickly. You have to go with the flow. I think this is where you've stumbled in the past. Trying to do things too quickly. You have to do it slowly. Patience is a virtue. Bottom of the deck, nine of wands. Don't be so heavily guarded. Let's get your advice, Capricorn. If you don't allow change to come in, balance can't come in. Don't spend too much time weighing. Learn the difference between your intuition and your self-defeating thoughts. You'll know what to cut out to gain balance. Yeah, 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 yeah. High priestess reversed, world reversed. You don't start listening to your intuition and knowing the difference between your intuition and your self-defeating thoughts. You repeat the same damn cycle over and over and over again. You have to learn the difference. You have to defeat your own ego. You have to defeat your own ego. And when your ego was wounded, that is how you get self-defeating thoughts. Do you understand what I'm trying to say, Capricorn? You have to be positive. You have to allow the positive to come in. Strengthen the tower reverse. You have to defeat your inner demon find the rebuild the tower and your inner demon is self-defeating thoughts you have to trust yourself so what if you've screwed up in the past everybody does it if you live if you live in the thought process of I'm just gonna screw it up again you're gonna screw it up again you have to learn to trust yourself you have to have patience Ten of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups reversed. Yeah, money's all well and good. Money pays the bills, but... Does money really make you happy? Six of Swords and the Hermit. Eventually, you got to cross those choppy waters and find that inner light. Death reversed at the bottom of the deck. You have to allow the change. If you don't allow the change within yourself, 
nothing else changes. All right, Capricorn, I love you. Have a hell of a rest of your October. I will catch you in your next reading. Know that you love and be blessed.